Well, hello to you there and a big greetings here from Perth, Australia. Matthew McDonald here and welcome to today's training session. We're looking at super cool, awesome video ads. And what we're gonna do in this really quick lesson is we're gonna look at how to use ready to go video ads and use them on our own site. Now we're gonna be using the WP Video Ads plugin, which makes it super duper easy to create video ads on our own site, just like the YouTube ones. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use one of our own videos, so one of those videos that you've got on your YouTube channel, and we're gonna go and find a relevant ad, relevant any kind of offer, maybe it's a JVZoo, Warrior Plus, ClickBank, or something that you're promoting, and we're gonna grab one of their sales videos or anything like that, and use it as a video ad on our own video. Now what's really cool about these video ads is people are already super engaged when they're watching the video ad. So if you think about the state people are in when they're watching a video, you're not like a banner on the side, like above the video or below the video or next to the video saying, hey, look at me, look at me. You're actually already smack bang in the center of their attention. So they're watching the video and then suddenly bang, the advertisement comes there. So if they're watching the video, they are definitely gonna see your ad. Not maybe, they're gonna see it. So let's go to my computer screen here and take a look at how to use ready to go videos as video ads on our own videos. Now to complete today's training session, all we're gonna need is our own video, which is gonna be the basic uh, training or tutorial or tip video or entertainment video. And then we're gonna need a video ad. Now for this example, for my training video, I'm using this ad custom videos to Facebook pages. This is a tutorial I did a little while back. And I've got it here on my blog and you can just see it here as the video. So if I look at my WordPress admin at the moment, I've just got a YouTube link there, which actually loads this particular video. So what we wanna do, instead of just having the video here, we wanna place an ad and monetize this video. So what I'm gonna do is, I've just already picked one here. And I'm just picking an affiliate offer here that would be relevant to my offer. And here we've got one, I just picked this up from the top sellers on JVZoo. And here you can see we've got a YouTube video and you can see the logo there so we can easily grab this video. And we're gonna use this video as a video ad. So it's gonna be really effective. It's gonna be more effective than putting a link or a banner on our site. So that's all we need. We need our video and we need our video ad. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna replace this on my WordPress blog here uh, with a video ad. So I'm here inside of WordPress admin and this is actually under media, WP video ads. And let's go ahead and create our video ad. So I'm just gonna put the title there, which is actually the same title as the post page. That's just for my own reference. And then we're gonna put in the master video. So going back over to YouTube here, this is gonna be the master video here, which is the uh, tutorial in this case. So I'm just grabbing the video ID there. And I'm gonna put it in there as the master video and then we're gonna put in our video ad. So going to the sales page here, I'm gonna use their main video as the video ad. I'm just gonna click the YouTube logo here. Like everyone now. And that takes me to the video and up here, I'm just gonna get the video ID. So here we've got V equals and video ID. Copying that. Back inside of WP video ads, let's just paste that in. And then we're gonna set at what point in the video we want this ad to appear. So for first, just for trials, let's just put it on at three seconds. I'm gonna include the skip video button and we've got it at five seconds. I'm gonna play around with that a little bit. And then we need our destination link. The destination link is gonna be our affiliate link. So in this case, I'm gonna go ahead and grab it. There we go from JVZoo, that's a JVZoo affiliate link, and I'm gonna just click Save Video Ad. Uh, 
and here's our video. Let's just preview this. Well, hello there and welcome back in this video. Hey there, I'm Kimberly. Let's get social, shall we? Just like there everyone we can see nowadays the video on Facebook. Starts. And with nearly two and billion... That's my we're skip take a video option. Now, what I want to do with this one, I want to actually let people go through the lesson. And before the end of it, I'm going to kick in that video ad. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in here. Let's put it at 10 minutes. Now your video should be really engaging if you're going to put it at 10 minutes. But that's what I'm going to do here. Save video ad. Let's play. Well, hello there, and I'm and going welcome to skip back ahead in this here. Video. We're going to take a look at a more effective way of. That size. I would normally do this. So in there we photo. go. Hey and there, I'm our Kimberly. Ad Let's in. get social. Now, if they click the video, the, the video pauses and they get sent to my affiliate link. So that's how easily we've monetized that particular video. Now all we need to do, copy the short code here. If you've got the premium version, you can also do a remote embed and pop that somewhere else. So grabbing the short code here and here on my post, I'm in the text view. I'm just gonna replace this YouTube link with my short code. I'm clicking update. There we go. And we'll go back here, reload the page. And now instead of just having a video, we've got a video with a video ad and we can earn some nice affiliate well, hello commissions. There and welcome back so let's in this jump video. ahead We're here. Gonna take a look at a size. I would normally do this in Photoshop. Hey there, I'm Kimberly. There's let's our video get social, ad. shall There's we? Our skip just like video everyone option. nowadays. If we click that, it's gonna take us to the affiliate offer, which is really cool. So now we can on Facebook. keep playing. And with just nearly two back. billion active users on Facebook, let's face it, it's just and skip ad brings us back to the video. Now, because they're waiting such a long time to actually before the ad appears, what I'm gonna do in this situation is I'm gonna increase the wait time here to 15 seconds and make them watch that video ad for 15 seconds to give them a chance to get really interested. So now if we reload the ad here, and we don't need to update the short code here, any changes I make are gonna be taking effect in real time. Well, and hello let's there jump and ahead welcome again. back in this video. We're gonna take a look at, I would normally do this in Photoshop. Hey there, I'm Kimberly. Now we can see let's we've get got social, the countdown shall we? here. Just like everyone nowadays on Facebook. And with nearly seconds. 2 billion active users on Facebook, let's face it, it's just too big to ignore. So that's a really After cool all, video ad. Your... And I'm just going to click it to pause it. Customers come interact. Back and watch the Share rest with of our it. friends and family. There we go. Super awesome, easy video ads and using ready to go video ads. Remember, sales videos actually make really great video ads. And the main thing is you want to make sure it's somehow relevant to the person who's viewing the video. Now you don't have to line up the ad exactly with the actual content in the video. Obviously it's going to work better if your video is about the same thing. For instance, if you're making a video about Facebook ads, then you want to have a Facebook ad video, but don't let that stop you. If you don't find a, a perfect match there, then just think about your audience and think about what they'd be interested in. So that, don't let that stop you from setting up your video ad. So thank you so much for joining me for today's training session. Matthew McDonald here, and I'll see you in part three.